Let's call this one getting the ah back in your life. Did you get a whole bunch of books for Christmas? <laughs> and do you look at those books and you say, yeah, as if I will ever have a chance to sit and read them? <laughs> those sort of things, the ah, or, or how about all the things, the goodies for the bath, as if you could luxuriate in your tub and have a half-hour bath where you just leaned back and said, ah. Or you, lo <laughs> you looked at your fridge or your living room or the top of your desk at work or at home like I am right now, and you looked and it was like in order and you could go, ah. And you looked at your tracker and you said, wow. I've done a lot in there for the week. I'm looking pretty good. Ah. Or you're having your bulletproof coffee, and I hope, Maria, that you found a recipe for it. Um, mine has probably changed since I did my video, but um, it's something that always gets adjusted and adapted. And I know one of the things I did was I went from one tablespoon of Xyla to half a tablespoon of Xyla. And it didn't hurt. So I like doing those things. Well, I'm getting I'm getting towards my ah with um just things. Um I've been real busy with a bunch of stuff, like most of you have, um, on the other side of um the holiday, not just um undoing the holiday things, but just keeping up with life as life's needs happen. So anyway, here we are. It's early January. And by my calculation, this should be when you finally, finally resolve to do something different. I saw a little quick Weight Watchers ad, and it gave no hints. They're very good at that, about what the program was about. It kind of had a woman dancing on it. So I hope that those of you that are doing the smart points um, are very happy with your results and the things that are happening. And that they kept the Simply Filling. I'm not really sure. I haven't had a chance to really do any surfing. I need an ah moment with the surfing. But I hope that um, it's all coming together for you. And that your food cravings and triggers are slowly going by the way of 2015. And that you can plug in and um, really hunker down to... Um, do what it is that you want to do. I don't know if you're thinking about goals or doing goals, but um, if you are, you know, stay tight, stay motivated, keep watching these videos. And so um, I think I might do a, a My Favorite Things video maybe today. Not sure. I got to do a lot of veggie prepping. Um, but um, there are some things that uh, I do enjoy that could be um, new to you or if you haven't watched before um, and coming on board and you haven't video watched 310 videos, what's wrong with you? Come on, it's winter. Where's, don't you have time? <laughs> don't you love that? So um, I did get my walk in yesterday and I look at the, um, the thermometer today and it's below 32. So um, I will be layering up and I did get a Carhartt all over my face with just a little circle here. <laughs> so when it's really, really bad out, I can walk. That's what I did with my Christmas gift card. So, um, the ah is a hard fought, hard won thing for most of us. There's always another, a next, a uh, let me just, I call them let me just, let me just get to this, let me just get to that. And um, I know you know what I'm talking about. And um, we really, ah, we do need that, that little bit of a downtime. And I think that um, in the last couple of days I've been utterly exhausted in getting, you know, and it's hard to really listen to your body because you get done with the holidays and you just move on to the next and there's no real um, allowing for 
what the exhaustion might be. I mean, it's quite a production for most of us. And um, from Thanksgiving on, the pressure and the need to um, make things, buy things, and and cook dinner, you know, the regular, um, the regular things that we do every week, every night, the cooking dinner, the packing lunch, you know, when you, if you're following a food plan and you're really doing it abstinently, then you wake up in the morning and you've got to pack what you're going to have for lunch, pretty much know what you're going to have for dinner, and perhaps somewhere in there, um, either eat breakfast before you leave or pack that too. And when I work, I just do a real quick um, flaxseed, coconut oil, full-fat yogurt, and um, peanut butter um, breakfast in a little glass dish. And um, I've been making the quiche. That seems to work well with my berries with a side of veggies. So that means I have to steam the veggies today. I've got some more organic broccoli and organic carrots and organic green beans. So I have to get those things going. Yesterday I was able to do some organic chicken thighs and um, a two and a half pound organic grass-fed beef pot roast. Yeah, so I'm kind of excited about that. Those things will last a while and um, I think tomorrow morning I'll make a quiche. Anyway, I'm busy doing the stuff that I'm doing just like you do and trying to squeeze in the ah moments and I have my my health magazines on Zinio, a Zinio app in my um, Kindle and uh, uh, or whatever it is, my Samsung tablet. And, um, you know, since November, I've gotten notices in my email account that, you know, my November issue is here of prevention. My December issue of, of health is here. <laughs> and it's just like I haven't gotten to them. I really want to get to them. So I keep piling on more things that I think I'm going to do today, including um, a video of my favorite things. We'll see. And then, doesn't my app for Movie Makers decide to be different because it's January 1st? So I lost the 14-minute one yesterday, and it was a really good one, rabbit, rabbit one. But anyway, about motivation for the year and the goals and the resolutions and stuff like that. But it's gone. I don't know where it went. But um, I'm glad it wasn't the cheat, defeat, um, treat one because I kind of like that one. So anyway, this is Saturday, January 2nd. So have a wonderful day. And if you have a lot of things that you plan to do today, good. If you've watched this with your bulletproof coffee or your regular coffee or, you know, in the car when you're driving to do what you need to do, good. Um, it's all good. And have a wonderful, productive day. But don't forget to take me time. Don't forget. Because it ain't happening if you work full time on Monday. <laughs> and let's not have a messy Monday. Because we've had, you know, four or five weeks of Mondays could be very messy because of um, parties and things like that. Let's make this Monday a nice, tight, abstinent Monday to go into. With all of your great food in place. Have a wonderful Saturday. Until the next time, it's Sarah, Pearls of Wisdom and Food. Bye-bye for now.